You're right, you know. We, uh, rushed you into this life here thinking it would help you, but being around me and, and Lois, I just kind of did the opposite. Look, I know you're not the same guy that killed my mom. I know that you would never intentionally hurt my dad, and yet I look at you and this alarm goes off. That's no way to live. What other choice do I have? Well, Natalie, I want you to have a choice, including whether or not you want to get to know me instead of being forced to live in the same house with me. What are you saying? What's this? An old friend of mine's had a place for rent for a while. I thought maybe you and your dad could check it out. So this would be like our own place? Mm-hmm. And then maybe you and I can get to know each other. See if we can't get that alarm to quiet down. Maybe. This is just a repair shop. I'm sure the living area is better. You found him? I found the suit. The chances that your father also survived are... That is not helpful, Hetty. We need to leave now. Follow that beacon. Our resources are limited. We may not be able to survive the trip. All I need is you, Dad. You and I'll be happy. Natalie, what would you like me to do? Get me to my dad. What do you think? Nat? It's perfect. You sure? Because Clark said that we Everything we need is right here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it is. I'll let Clark know, all right? 